This is Darius from therabbitpad.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can change the spacing between a bullet and the text that goes with that bullet or the number in a number list and the items that you're listing. So I have Google Docs open here and I'm going to create a bulleted list and I will just list some colors for simplicity's sake. So orange, green, yellow, and red. Now some people like the spacing that is between the bullet and the word and some people don't. And if you don't like this, this is how you can reduce the spacing between the bullet and the word make sure that your ruler is activated and if you can't see the ruler at the top of the page in google docs what you'll need to do is go to the view option at the top of the screen and make sure that show ruler is selected and these little blue this blue line and this blue triangle are what helps show the margins or boundaries or placement of the text in your document. So if you want to reduce the space between the bullet and the word, all you do is you go and select this line and you shift it over, but not so much that it touches the triangle, but to shift it over a little bit and you'll see that the bullet has moved. I'm gonna see if I can move it over a little bit more. Sometimes that messes it up. See, I can't move it over as much as I want, but a little bit of space has been reduced and I was actually able to move it over a little bit more. You can also do this with multiple lines of text at a time by following that same process. And now all of my bullets are closer to the text. The same way or the same process can be used if you're using a numbered list. So I'm going to try this with a number list to show you that the process is the same. So orange, green, yellow, red. Now I'm going to place my cursor next to the spacing I want to change. I'm gonna move it over and that didn't work because it was too close to the triangle. So I tried it again, making sure that the line is not touching the triangle and I was able to reduce that space in between the text and the bullets or number lists. This is not a foolproof system. You might get better results with Microsoft Word or Apple's pages, but this is a quick solution for that issue in Google Docs. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel so that you can receive updates when I publish videos in the future. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.